Regimus Maximus, and I'm back yet again. And today, this is one I've been waiting for. Today, we're checking out the Transformer Siege War for Cybertron. Cog, get ready. This is going to be great. Regimus Maximus Okie dokie. Like I said before, this is one that I have been waiting for. Um, I'm a big fan of Fortress Maximus. Um, so when Fortress came out and he didn't have Cog with him, I was kind of disappointed. But now, during the Siege line, here they go bringing some of these characters back. You know, you got Cog. I think later on you're going to get like um. Six gun for Metroplex, but this was um, Fortress Maximus's guy right here, Cog. So let's go ahead and take a look at him. There's Cog in the box. You can see the artwork of his vehicle modes. And the back of the box. And let's see, you can put um you sideswipe with him, so we will be doing that. So yeah. And the artwork on the side. And there we have Cog. So without further ado, I'm excited and I want to jump in there. So let's just open it. Let's just open it. All right, we now have Cog out the box. Yeah, I'm finally happy to actually have him out the box and taking a good look at him. I mean, I've been waiting for this. And I'm pretty happy about it. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at some of the detail. Uh. Get it zoomed in real good. There we go. Well, I think he's a good looking figure. Like the way they mixed it up and added that silver right there. The original G1 version didn't have that. I'll pop up a picture to show you that. There it is. So you can see the comparison. legs you don't really see the scuff stuff as much like a, some paint right there but it's not like the scuffing of um, scuffed up paint like it was on Sideswipe there's a little bit right there too but like I said it's still not as much the back side of him Here's the side. Put it back so you can better view. And the front, of course. Some painted red right there. Not bad, uh, not bad. All right, the next thing we're going to do is compare him to his G1 counterpart. Pow, there it is. So you can see what that looks like. Four size comparison, here he is, next to the Siege Sideswipe, and next to Titan's Return Chrome Dome, and next to Power of the Primes, Rodimus Unicronus. So there you go. Now for the next thing, we're going to go ahead and transform him into his vehicle modes. Alrighty. So what we're going to do is just 
screen apart like so we're going to go ahead and transform this part first what you're going to do is you're just going to rotate this right here and there's there's some pegs right here you just slide them to the slots right there like so all right you add his guns and there you go for this part the bottom section of his vehicle mode now the next part is simple just take his head turn around you're gonna flip this down like so you're gonna take his guns his guns from his arms just put them right here and there you go so there are those two as you can see and we're going to pop up the G1 version as reference and there you go now you can also put these guys together so what you're going to do is here's a tab in back only thing you got to do is tab them together if you want to put these guns on top of here you can um, this right here slides up so that way you can uh, roll into battle and be able to shoot that much more so not bad so size comparison here he is next to moon racer and punch counter punch double spy there you go so what we're going to do now is we're going to take this and we're going to take this part and we're going to bring it up like so and then we're going to take these and fold these in like so and this is going to create a shield you pull this out and there you go he holds that so lay this over here all right you can also take his waist part and what you want to do is you're going to grab his arm parts you're going to take these and just peg them in there right here so there's so many different ways you can do this i mean you create it if you think of something different hey go for it how about i just go in there i can go for it you just take that and you just peg that into one of their backs. His legs, pretty much simple. Just take these and fold these in like that. And what we're going to do is we're going to use side swipe. So we're going to take him. And we're going to just put him on top of him like that. <sighs> so the foot pegs, like I said before, I thought he was too short anyway, so that kind of helps his height. Kind of gives him big shoes, but kind of helps his height. Next thing we're going to do is let's go ahead and take um, what I shows. And with this right here on the side of him. So let's go ahead and see if we can do that. So yeah, we're going to do that. Just like that. We're going to take this part. And it's going to tab right back here. There we 
we go. And you can also take these and you can, if you want to put one in this hand, put them in this hand. You can put them right here. Or heck, if you want to, you can put one right there. I mean, it's all up to you. So, it's whatever you can think of. And here's a side view. You know, with these guys um, and all these weaponizers on them, um, it kind of puts you in the mind of Transformers Revenge of the Fallen when um, Jetfire um, pretty much gave his body parts to Optimus Prime. I mean, it's pretty much the same thing. So, I mean, it's just more Transformers doing the same thing. So, I think it's a pretty neat idea. Um, a lot of the stuff still falls back from just a variation of the Target Master series, so Target Master, Headmasters, so um, Power of the Primes was basically what the Headmasters, no, the Headmasters were the Titans Return, so I mean, um, I think Power of the Primes were basically um, uh, Power Masters, what that was, so yeah. There you go. Here is another way he can be displayed. As you can see, he's got the guns all on him. He's got the shield. His legs transform into those guns, which his, his arms can also attach to. So, that's just another way to display him, to weaponize him. Alright, we're back at this point. Now, it's going to be our giveaway day. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to reach in my trusty dusty cup of names and I'm going to pull a name out. In fact, I'm going to pull two names out. So, here we go. <laughs> Let's go ahead and drop that one. Reach it in. Mix it up again. And we got James Rackley. So he's the winner of one. And we have Joe Mast. The second. So Joe Master or Joe Master the second. Those are our two winners. So there you go. If you want to win something, we got more prizes coming. Um, all you gotta do is comment, like, subscribe, do something. We're trying to get our name out there. We're actually trying to get some prizes away. All you gotta do is check back of these videos and claim your prize. That's all you gotta do. A lot of people ain't been doing that. So, if you want to win, check back. That's all I have. Just check back. Regimus Maximus, again, with Transformer Siege Cog. Once again, I am out. Thank you.